This video demonstrates building alkanes using a model set. Before we begin, let's identify the different pieces in your model set that are useful for building an alkane. The black ball with the four prongs represents a carbon atom in the sp3 hybridization state. The gray hollow link represents a single bond. The white ball with one prong represents hydrogen. To start, let's make a simple alkane, hexane. Pull out of the model set six carbon atoms and five single bonds. First, connect a carbon atom to both sides of a single bond. Next, connect another single bond to one of the carbon atoms. Then, connect a carbon to the empty side of the last single bond that you added. Repeat the last two steps until all the single bonds and carbon atoms are used. This is an unbranched hexane molecule. Complete this model by adding a single bond and a hydrogen to each available bond. Now let's make a cyclohexane. Begin with a hexane molecule from the first alkane you made. Remove one hydrogen from each end of the molecule. Attach a single bond to one of the end carbons. Then, connect the other end carbon to the empty side of the single bond you just attached. The resulting molecule is a cyclohexane. Let's make a more complex alkane. 3-ethyl-2,2,5-trimethylhexane. For this structure, you will need the hexane molecule from the first alkane you made plus five carbon atoms. Assemble a methyl group by attaching a carbon atom to one of the sides of a single bond. Add three hydrogens. Make a total of three methyl groups. Assemble an ethyl group by attaching a carbon atom to one of the sides of a single bond, like you did for the methyl group, and then connecting another single bond to that carbon atom. Add five hydrogens. Now let's assemble the alkane. Counting from the farthest left carbon, remove two hydrogens from carbon two. Remove one hydrogen from carbon three. Remove one hydrogen from carbon five. Attach two methyl groups to carbon two. Attach the ethyl group to carbon three. Attach the third methyl group to carbon five. The finished product is a 3-ethyl-2,2,5 trimethylhexane molecule. 